What do you want to start at anyway? What do you want to bring to our listeners? Do you want to start with food? Do you want to talk about I want to talk about the tower. Tower. Oh, let's talk about the tower, shall we? Well in advance, I had already had plans on taking you up to the tower for your birthday. I wanted to do this because um, being the time of year, I was hoping leaves have already turned by the time we got up there. And it would have made a glorious view up there with all the leaves it turning and stuff It would have been beautiful. And it already us. was. And it was still gorgeous. Even though it was cloudy that day, it was still nice. Okay. Okay. So we get there and we yes. park. We go in and the first thing you see when you first walk in is a souvenir shop. Mm-hmm. They have snacks you can buy, drinks you can buy also. But you walk over, you tell the guy you want to go up in the tower. Mm-hmm. You pay him, I think it was like seven bucks a person. It's like a little over like seven fifteen. It's weird. Yeah. You don't find that very often for stuff like that. Usually no. it's like seven fifty or seven. Mm-hmm. You pay them, they give you a little coin, a token. Token. Which you put it in the little turnstile. Turnstile like going mm-hmm. into the subway. And that's how you get up into the Tower. You and go through that and you get in the elevator. Get in the elevator and you go up. I have video footage of that. I plan on putting that up on our YouTube channel. So if you are interested in looking at that and seeing what we saw, you just get a real understanding of how high we went. Right. Because yeah. it, it keeps going. The, the, the levels keep going by and you're going, wow, they're still going up. There's, you're still going up. I know. Exactly. Um, I'm trying to find out how tall that tower is. Okay. I was thinking that it's built 600 feet above. Is it uh, 600 feet above the uh, sea level? I think so. And then the tower's another 600. Right. So, well, that, that would explain it. Does that make sense? Yeah, because it says right here the deck that we get ended up coming out on is um, 1,256 feet. So you're okay, so I, thinking correctly. Yeah, I, I started to say I think the tower's like 650. Right. And then that it was 600 above sea level 600. where it's built so at the base. It, it, it adds up to over 1,200 yeah. square feet. Or 1,200 square feet. <laughs> you do that. 12, I know. <laughs> twelve, and It's a carpenter's thing. Um, but 1,200 feet above sea level. Right. And, I mean, that means, guys, the view was incredible. It, oh, it, it just, was. We were up there. It was misting. There was fog in the distance in some mm-hmm. areas. And we're just still going, wow. Yeah. This is beautiful. You can see up to a hundred, according to this, which I believe it, especially on a clear day, 140 miles. Right. In all directions. Nearby, we could see a, um, what was it? A little theme park. Amusement park. Yeah. Amusement park. Yep. And, um, the roller coasters looked very small. They did look pretty small from there. But you can see all of Hot Springs from up there. We could see our hotel. You can see our hotel. You can see the Arlington. You can see the, you can see the, all the bathhouses are down there. Right. Everything. You can see everything for 140 miles. It was a very cool view. And I, I would definitely take people up there again. And like we said, it's only like seven something. It's worth it. It is really worth it. It and, really is. And I felt safe. Yeah, that's Other true. than the elevator. The elevator did weird things that made things kind of go, are we going to die? <laughs> is it, we're but, all going to die. But it was fine. It just made its own little special noises. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, no, the, the fencing up at the top, we were laughing about it because I was like, it's like Jurassic Park. <laughs> Jurassic Park. They're trying to keep the dinosaurs in. <laughs> Are we the dinosaurs? That's per- what I was wondering. I feel like a dinosaur some days. Most days anymore. But, um, yeah, I think it's, it's really worth the, the, the money to go up to it. It's worth the time to look out over. We probably spent, what, 30 minutes up there, maybe just taking photos, taking in the view, talking about the area, you know, um, just really, it does give you a sense of just how, uh, in the woods hot springs is. It really does. And how huge this place really is as far as, like how much tree and forest land is is that it sits in the middle of. So I mean it's it's really nice. I really like that. I'm glad we did that. It was a lot of fun. I I'm glad we did it when we did it too because we did it our first day, and that made it a lot of fun too. What happened to your voice? It's going in and out. Be nice. It sounds cute. Hold on. <coughs> is it back? Sorry. Of eh, I think we're losing. <laughs> We're losing, so we need to record quick. Sure, let's do this. <laughs> okay, so the tower, uh, highly recommend. You do a little uh, switchbacks going on the way up there. You, you oh, can, driving up to it, Driving yes. up to it. You can walk up to it. Yeah, but if, you, if you're a hiker, you can hike it. There's only one entrance, and it's over by the Arlington Hotel. You have to go up, th- up the road that is over by the Arlington Hotel. You only have one entrance, and you have one exit. So, right, so you don't have to worry about coming head-to-head with a car. Right, and there's a little turnout, turnoffs or... Uh, 
stops. Pull offs. Pull offs. Mm-hmm. That's the word. Pull offs along the way, so if you you can look at the view or whatever. Right. It it, it really was a nice, relaxing way to start out. It's like a miniature Pikes Peak. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> really miniature. <laughs> <With> the switchbacks. <laughs> Um, yeah, really super miniature, right? This, the switchbacks were not nearly as terrifying. No, they weren't. And, okay, so, um, oh, and that's the other thing. Listen, um, if you go up into the, um, the tower, they do have an enclosed area. You don't have to go out into the walkway. Right. So if, if, you, if you're afraid, yeah. You can see some of it, like half of the view. Not as well. But you can go up there, and you you don't have to worry about like you know getting like Sandy said too frightened. So right, like Olivia, it would be good for her because she could go up in there, and if she decided to venture, venture out, out, she would be mm-hmm. okay. Yeah, 